Thanks to the doctors and specialists at UNC Hospitals, one child's life has been transformed in the past year. I checked in with a four-year-old from Fort Mill, South Carolina, who's developing his sense of hearing. Send talk to him, Daddy. Daddy loves you. A little more than a year ago, Grayson Clamp heard his father's voice for the first time thanks to a medical advancement called an auditory brainstem implant, or ABI. Now he and his family are learning what life looks and sounds like. Nicole Clamp is Grayson's mom. Oh, he is a sweet, sweet little boy, very curious. Um, he likes to know how things work. And many other people want to know just how well Grayson's new hearing implant works. Grayson is the first child in the United States to have it, and Holly Teagle explains that this implant is unlike others. Instead of the device, the electrode uh, being placed in the cochlea, the electrode that stimulates hearing is placed higher in the brain stem. And for Grayson, the result is hearing. He was born deaf, but the ABI is a new source of hope. We really hope that having the ABI will help him be able to have intelligible speech. Because Grayson had never heard his own voice until a year ago, his vocal development has been slowed. He's still the, he's, he's a, a rascal and uh, a busy guy, but um, he's using sound meaningfully now, and he alerts to his name and to many environmental sounds. There's still a lot to learn about how the implant really works with children, but at least for Grayson, it seems to be having a positive effect. It has, I think, enriched his life life because he experiences things more fully. Even though Grayson has such a unique story, he really is your typical four-year-old energetic boy. But the implant does seem to be making an impact on his life.